Hi and welcome back to MRTV. In this video I'm going to measure the FOV of the PlayStation VR 2 in PC VR here because I'm using the PC adapter, yes. So without further ado, let's directly do this. I didn't bring this to you in my first video, so here we go. So just to remind you, the Pimax Crystal, I have like 102 degrees with it. G2, I have like 90-ish degrees with it. Let's see what I can get here. So this is G2, I, see, I still see it. I still see it, 100 degrees, I still see it. 104 degrees, I still see it. 106, I still see it. 108, I still see it. 110, I still see it. 112, yes, I can still see it. 40, yes. 116, I still see both. 118, probably not anymore. 116, yes. Wow, 116, it's an, this is incredible. This is more than I see with the Valve Index. So a very, very nice horizontal FOV. And that's what I was telling you all the time about, that I really, really enjoy the FOV of the PSVR 2. And it's also way more than I get with the Quest 3. So yeah, good. Let's do the vertical. FOV. So I see the, the red dot exactly in front of me. So that is balanced out, which is good. Still see them. Oh, the G2 now would be over. Still see it, still see it. Still can see it. Okay, I think now it's over. Yes. Let's see. No. I would say 102. 102. Yes. So, here we go. This is my result with the PlayStation VR 2. 160 degrees horizontally, 102 degrees vertically. So, this is more than Quest 3. This is more than um, the Crystal Light. This is way more than the Big Screen Beyond. And it is incredible. It is truly incredible to have this kind of FOV. You know what? Why not also just directly in AB comparison check out the Quest 3 so that we really have the direct AB comparison. Let's do this. All right. So now we are here in the Quest 3 and yeah, it's not as bright directly. The AB comparison and the colors simply are not as nice, but let's see what we can do with the FOV. So we had 116 horizontally in the PSVR 2. Let's also press this as close as possible to my eyes. And here the maximum I can get is, still see it? Still see it at 100? Still see it at 102? I still see it at 104? 106, I don't see it anymore. So 104. 104 in the Quest 3 compared to 116 in the PSVR 2. That is a huge difference. That is a huge difference. Okay, let's do it with the vertical FOV. Also, the vertical FOV is balanced, as in zero is exactly on my line of sight, so that is good. So we had 102 with the PSVR 2. And here now, I can still see it. Okay, now it's already getting tough to see the top one. So it's not exactly balanced. Yeah, I would say that it's 90. Because the top one is gone. I can, I can still see the bottom one, but I, I don't see both at the same time. So the last time I see the top one is at 86 actually. So it is not actually perfectly balanced. So it's tough to say what to choose for this. 
probably like okay on the bottom I can see further hmm tough so uh, the last time I see both balls is at 86 and the last time I see the bottom one is 102 so something between 102 and 86 right so probably 96 or something I would I would say then that is fair yeah so this is my result for the yeah for the quest 3 it's an amazing headset as well but in terms of ever v the playstation vr like easily wins 116 versus 104 horizontally and 102 versus 96 vertically so definitely a big win for the playstation vr 2 here simply wanted to bring you this video to yeah to complete my um, review right of the playstation vr 2 happy to bring you this short video hope that you enjoyed it so um just to put it in, into perspective with the crystal with the pyrex crystal i have 102 and 102 for both so also the psvr2 wins and um, for the big screen beyond i had like probably it was also like something like 100 horizontally or, or, or 90 something yeah I've I've put it into, into my big screen beyond review but it was definitely not as high as the Pimax as, as, as the PSVR 2 so PSVR 2 is winning here in terms of FOV very nice so do let me know about your comments is that also what you feel when going from the quest 3 to the to the psvr 2 do let me know in the comment section of this video and um, yeah if you have not yet subscribed to mrtv absolutely do that now and you know what i'm looking forward to see you in the next one until then bye bye